So you put the the special that we're referring to, by the way, everyone is called the Hustler, and I I liked how personal. I mean, you got very personable. I mean, you 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 clearly had a divorce, um, and Kelsey yeah. put it out there, and then and you put on YouTube. Yeah, yeah. And so the YouTube, what what is playing on the plane that I saw? Is that straight from YouTube? Like what? It, it can't be, right? Right. So 800 Pound Gorilla is ah. the production company who shot it. And they had a licensing deal with United. And so it was playing on United flights. And then it recently, as of like two weeks ago, got picked up on Hulu and Disney+. Plus. So, so crazy. I mean, you never guess when it goes on YouTube a year ago that it could possibly then later go on streamers. Because you just go, oh, well, people didn't want it. I'll put it on YouTube. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Did you say Disney Plus? Yeah, where I'm like, do did they watch it? Do they know what? <laughs> well, that's I was gonna say. Like, do they do they watch the whole thing? Or did like... they see the three minute bit about eating <laughs> or is everything like what? Who is? <laughs> it's like so weird that you can watch like the fox and the hound, and then like me. <laughs> <laughs> what I described it to was, I mean. You would go in areas where I was like, oh, of course they're going in that area. But then sure. you do it, you do it in a manner of like, I like the way you tackled that. That was Thank really freaking you. funny. So thanks. I appreciate it. Are you out there touring now? I am. Yep. Just it's been kind of nonstop. It's funny. I opened for Jim Norton on tour for three years and wow. then transitioned to headlining three years ago so it's been been like three years of kind of non-stop doing like as many markets as i can now and and then with the special coming out that's really helped keep tickets going too so it's it's been exciting and um yeah i've been loving it all right so i want to know so you're you turn with jim who i love Mm -hmm. love jim norton question um Because I remember touring, I was with Atel, Norton, and Bill Burr. And, wow, God, what a lineup. And I was, the, it was interesting because I was the only guy that didn't curse. Not that okay. I, I, was just, you know, I just, I turned a corner and I was just like, I'm not going to, I'm, I'm going to do this type of material. And yeah. this, was, this was a while ago. And I was, and I was sticking with it. And I, st- and I still don't. But it's not like, hey, man, you got to be clean. It's not clean. Yeah. But I guess what I'm alluding to is Attell and Norton would <laughs> you Jim Brewer <laughs> Norton Attell yeah. Burr we were we were so far and oh wide. my god universes you'd, you'd have you have Attell going sometimes I stick my in the fishbowl just to let him know who's boss. <laughs> uh, you, right. You, yeah. You have Norton over here hitting like A's, a bucket of A's. And, uh, and then you have Bill Burr like, you know, you know, once in a while I gotta punch a chick right in the face. I'm like, oh my God. And then you know, I'm sitting there like, so I live in Florida and these flamingos. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like a- back by an ostrich. So I guess the the point, the point yeah. of the story is, was your, <laughs> I don't really know Norton's crowd or, yeah. his, or his, his diehard following because his, mm-hmm. his radio following different than stand up. Right. Was that an easy <laughs> transition for you? Cause I would assume I'm assuming. Yeah. If, if, if Kelsey Cook is, if you're the opening act and I'm there for a Norton show, Oh. You better, you better bring it quick. <laughs> you better, better bring it quick. You better be f-ing starting your joke <laughs> from backstage <laughs> because they. I mean, think about the feelings you had about me before you started watching my special, where you automatically were like, 100%. "I'm gonna, I'm gonna hate watch this. Like, yes. I'm gonna watch this I just because I don't think I'm gonna like it." So with Norton's crowds, and then I don't know if you know Club Soda Kenny. Of course uh, I do. Okay. So, you know, he, Kenny would do the voice of God to bring me out because it was, I would like cold open. These, these hey, were everybody, 
put it, your hands together. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> so this is, these are theater gigs, cold open, and Kenny would just, oh my God, he'd go, ladies and gentlemen, Jib Norton. And it would go, ah. And then he'd go, but first. And you could just <laughs> feel everybody go, God damn it. And then I would walk out and just, you could see like 50 people like, this is a good time to take a shit and just immediately get up and like, like not even willing to give it a shot because I just walked out looking absolutely nothing like what they would imagine a Norton opener looking Correct. like. Correct. I um, saw you as part-time teacher. For sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I definitely have like, I think a Midwestern vibe. Like when older people see my headshot on club calendars, they go, oh, she looks like our granddaughter. And then they go and they're like, oh, she's not our granddaughter. And they like <laughs> are really sometimes not happy with, with what yeah. comes out of my mouth. And I'm not, I'm not that dirty. It's just, no, I look like I'm going to be so clean that I think it can be kind of shocking if I just say people are like, <gasps>